Welcome to the Papros TV Africa Entertainment News. I am Vivian Alubizi and today is 20th June 2023. Gospel music is a thriving part of the Nigerian music industry. Mesonen Dachinwo is a Nigerian gospel musician, singer, actress, comedian and a songwriter. She started singing at the age of six in her church children's choir. In 2018, she released the hit single, Esther's Love. Jesus, you love me too much, oh, too much, oh, too much, oh, excess love, oh. Jesus, you love me too much, oh, too much, oh, too much, oh, excess love, oh. She is one of Nigerians' best. Messi Chinwo was recently honored at the UK Premier Gospel Awards that took place on June 9, 2023. She received the award for the Best International Gospel Act for her achievements as a leading voice on the continent. <music> Meanwhile, the Nigerian Afrobeat superstar Omale on June 15, 2023, released the deluxe version of his debut album, Boy Alone. Since he broke into the scene in 2020 with his hit debut, Ep, Get Lead, Omale has become a global household name. The deluxe version comes off the back of the release of Soso Remix, featuring Ozuna, which was his first release of 2023. <laughs> It has the UK rapper Edge appearing on Imagine. Sat on the couch in my field, same place we would dream about that house in the hills. No matter what happens, you can count on me still. Said you found somebody better, but I doubt it for real. Yeah. On a sad note, Nollywood industry has been plunged into grief following the untimely death of veteran actor. Don Brimo Uchegu, who died at the age of 56 on Wednesday night, reportedly succumbing to a partial stroke and elevated blood sugar levels. We are sure going to miss him. May his soul rest in perfect peace. Famous Ghanaian actress Yvonne Nelson has alleged that a Nigerian artist in Yaya cheated on her with Nollywood screen diva, actress Tonto Dike. The actress stated that Yaya assured her of how deep he was in love with her, to a point that he tattooed her initials YN on his wrist and also included her name in one of his hit songs. Your waist. She said she broke up with him when she discovered that Tonto Dickey was constantly passing the night at his house in her absence. She also said she got a call from someone. When she returned to Ghana after one of her visits to Nigeria, the caller said, Anytime I left Inyanyan's place, another actress do come over to his place and sometimes pass the night with him. The person sensed some strong connections between them and thought it wise to inform me. I was heartbroken when I discovered the actress was turned to the king. Moreover, 
I later heard some stories about him and his female crew members. I was convinced that what happened between him and Tonto Dickey wasn't an isolated incident. That's his way of life. I knew I would have broken up with him even if Tonto Dickey wasn't involved. There was no point fighting over a man that have already lost with her, she concluded. See you next week and keep watching the Papro Steve Africa. I am Vivian Alubizi.